The 30-year-old actor has been seen on the ITV soap on and off since 2008. Playing such a complex and emotional character is important to Danny, and he has since spoken openly about his own personal journey with mental health troubles. Throughout lockdown Danny confessed that he has had to deal with some of the worst moments, crediting both his partner Steph and dog Jenny for getting him through. Now, becoming a dad for the first time, Danny is using his family once again to help him get through the tougher moments of I'm a Celeb. Within the Welsh castle, it was former footballer David Sheen Ola who was there to comfort Danny after he admitted to feeling a little bit homesick. With words of wisdom and reassurance David said, concentrate on the food and think about how lucky you are. You have a lovely wife, a three-week-old baby boy. You need to be strong for them as well. They want to see you strong. When your son is going to watch the program, he's going to say, wow. Daddy was strong. He is a strong man. He is my idol. I know it's hard. Believe in yourself and your capability. You're very talented, Danny. High blood pressure, the vitamin supplements which can significantly lower it. A tearful Danny thanked the footballing legend, who he ended up sharing a bed with, after the pair were voted as camp leaders. Looking back on the emotional roller coaster, Danny admitted that he has never experienced anything like it in his life. Watching from home, his family and friends also shared a heartwarming picture to Instagram, featuring a letter Danny had written to himself in case he found himself struggling. The caption read, Danny is definitely making us proud. Let's hope his smile is back tonight. Omicron variant, the scratchy symptom that's showing up in people infected with Omicron, latest Pfizer booster shot, the unexpected side effect after third dose, tips Omicron warning as hospital wards in South Africa filling up with young patients, in sight, within the picture, a smiling Danny is holding a sign that reads, Dear Danny, Remember why you are doing this. Try to keep up the mood of your campmates with laughter, impressions, accents and jokes. And make Steph, Albert, Jenny, Kenny and the whole family proud. Love, Danny. More than most, actor Danny understands the importance of mental health. In the past he has talked about his struggle with both anxiety and depression, and encouraged others to seek help if they are feeling a similar way. Talking about his anxiety and depression in the past, again via social media, Danny has said, Anxiety and depression grabs you and shakes you no matter who you are or what walk of life. And I hope you read this post, and yes you may cringe, and see the bigger picture. Talk to someone, and allow someone to love you and love them in return. And then, like me, hopefully, you too can see a genuine path to welcoming and dealing with the horrible, invisible illness that is anxiety and depression. I hope you find that partner and that friend. Like me. And if you're still reading this. You're doing great and I'm glad you exist. Anxiety and depression are two of the most common mental health conditions in the UK. In fact, the Anxiety and Depression Association of America predicts that around 264 million people worldwide live with depression. Experts from the National Alliance of Mental Illness NAMI, go further to state that 60% of people with anxiety also have symptoms of depression. Common symptoms of depression include the following persistent sad, anxious or empty mood feelings of hopelessness, pessimism feelings of guilt, worthlessness, 
helplessness, loss of interest or pleasure in hobbies and activities, including sex decreased energy, fatigue, feeling slowed down difficulty concentrating, remembering, making decisions insomnia, early morning awakening, or oversleeping low appetite and weight loss or overeating and weight gain thoughts of death or suicide, suicide attempts restlessness, irritability persistent physical symptoms that do not respond to treatment, such as headaches, digestive disorders and pain for which no other cause can be diagnosed. Whereas common signs of anxiety include feeling nervous, restless or tense having a sense of impending danger, panic or doom having an increased heart rate breathing rapidly, hyperventilation sweating trembling feeling weak or tired trouble concentrating or thinking about anything other than the present worry having trouble sleeping experiencing gastrointestinal GI problems having difficulty controlling worry having the urge to avoid things that trigger anxiety. Although everyone deals with mental health differently, effective ways of coping with mental health include therapy. This includes cognitive behavioral therapy and interpersonal psychotherapy alongside antidepressant medication, exercise and relaxation techniques. If you or someone you know is experiencing severe anxiety and depression as well as suicidal thoughts, you can reach out to the Samaritans on 116-123 or joe at samaritans.org, 24 hours a day.